Hey guys, Damien Pace Tutorials here, and I'm here with another um, of my Sony Vegas Pro Tool tutorials. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make your um, movies look like Hollywood movies with um, larger black bars, um, red midtones, and 24 frames per second um, FPS ratings. Now, first off, you got to um, bring in your movie that you're using. You don't have to do this, but I'm gonna drag down my audio track and delete that and fade this in and out. Now, first off, you gotta go to File and Properties or Alt plus Enter. Now, go to Settings and look for HDV 720-24P or if you record it 1080p um, quality video with your camera, HDV 1080-24P. This because my Nikon doesn't record 1080. Apply. Okay. All right. So now that we have that, it is a bit um, choppier. Now, go to your track um, right here. Go to Track FX, and then look for Color Corrector, and click Add, and go to OK, and then go to Custom, and I'll drag it somewhere in your thing so you can see what it looks like. We're gonna make this look a bit like a Hollywood movie. Drag your low up to the red area a bit, like around the magnitude of. You can use these settings if you want, but you can do whatever you want. Mine are at my angle is at 103.6, and my magnitude is um, 0.526. Now in mid, you want to set it to a yellowish color, but not too yellow. You want again if you want to use my settings. 132.9 for angle, um, 2.296 for magnitude. And then high, you want to give a little bit of a blue cyan shade. And of course, if you want to use mine, um, 323.1 for angle and magnitude is 0.310. And then right here is your saturation levels. You can mess with this, whatever you want to do. Gamma, you can mess with just the brightness. You can adjust that to whatever you want. I'm gonna set one offset. It messes it off. I don't know what you want to use that for. Green. Yeah. I'm. I'm just keep yours at standard settings. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Okay. And then you're done for that. And now we've got to do something else. Add the giant black bars. Now, good to, um, you're, sadly you're gonna have to do this for all of your video tracks, so it might be hard to get it exact, but go to Event Pan Crop. Make sure this is set to Move in Y only, and then drag down your thing a bit so you can have those black bars, and let's um, trade these off. Make sure you get the first keyframe too, so we. Now we have these giant black bars, you can move these to whatever you want it to look like if you want right there. You don't have to set this to Y, but it's easier so you don't move it over by accident. Now I'm going to leave mine like that. Exit out, and there you have the black bars. Isn't that um, cool? Woohoo. Now you have the black bars. Are we done? No. There's still one more thing we got to do. When you're going to render this, make sure when you go to File, Render As, name it like Hollywood or something. Now, if this if you record it in 1080, set it at 1080-24p, um, 6.4 megabits per second HD. If you um, did 720, like mine, you do 4.8 megabits per second HD, 720-24p video. So you set that and hit Render. Yes. And shabam, you are now rendering the movie that you just made. Now, do you want to see the movie so it's not all choppy? Don't worry, of course, I'm not going to be that mean. I'm going to show you, so here's the movie right now. Well, there you have it. 
there's the tutorial on how to make a Hollywood style movie. If this helped you out, please definitely subscribe, like, comment, and share this video to Facebook and Twitter and whatever. So see you guys, bye.